I always was disappointed because obviously no one would be able to compromise for me fully because I would give my all and put my all into things and they would just I would just never be compensated for the the love I would give. So as far as compromise, um, for one, don't put your pride don't put your pride in the fucking relationship. The shit doesn't work. It makes the shit harder than it needs to be. It makes it complicated. It it, it makes everything hard. Do not put your ego in a relationship. Yo, like, you can really accomplish anything you want to accomplish. Bro, you guys are amazing beings, amazing people. Yo, I ain't spreading nothing but love, compassion, magnificence, excellence, fucking art, and love to y'all. I'm not sending y'all no bullshit. Any negative and any negativity sent my way is being transmuted to positive energy. So any attention that's being set, sent my way, I want to let you guys know that I will only entertain it from a positive perspective, and that's just in general with anything. It's not about what's thrown at you, it's about how you deal with it, and everything is constantly a level up. The whole process from birth until now is to evolve, whether it be physically or mentally, but you cannot evolve physically and not evolve mental love you, because that tells a story in itself, you know what I'm saying? I love you guys. Yeah, you guys, are, you guys are fucking awesome. I love you guys. Be happy and be yourself, always. I hope everyone has a positive day today. All right, guys, let's start our fucking day positive today, man. To everyone that supports me and everything I do, I love you all. I love you all more than I love myself. You all mean the world to me. Your support is what keeps me alive. If you're listening to this. I love you. Today I wanted to tell my fans to wake up with a purpose Whether it be something small, whether it be something only I do to you As long as you wake up with a purpose, you will be in positive energy today Peace, love, positivity, blessings to you all I just want to take a second to tell everyone that supports me And that shows me that they appreciate me, that I appreciate all of you And that I would not be in a better state of mind if it wasn't for you guys And I will continue to try and motivate you in a positive way And show you love in a positive way I fucking love you guys for all the love and support I fucking love all of you guys Hey, let's make the internet crash, can we? Can we like, go like super crazy and make them super mad that I'm not in jail? Hey, I also... I don't... I don't... I also really wanted to say that I was pro X. I keep uh keep X in jail. You should have kept me in jail. <laughs> I'm I'm sorry, Joe. I didn't. I don't. Not aware of this kind of stuff. All right. So. All right. So yeah, I've been out for like three days. I'm not even gonna lie. I literally, um, I literally hopped on a plane and just came here from from New York on the way. Hold on. I would have not. Yeah, I've been out for like three days. I'm not gonna lie, I just really didn't even want to say anything because I was I wanted to do something like super cool. Cause you know most niggas just come out, drop a song, first day out. I wanted to do like I was gonna like run a casket, get in the casket, and then say viral, and then like that's how. Listen, bro, I hate mental pain. I'm good at physical pain. Cause it it only goes so far. They ain't gonna kill you unless they trying to kill you. I'm built for that. Cause it's only three seconds. It's the bro. It's like all right. Nigga, shoot me, bro. That's the easiest way out. You shoot me in my brain, that's the easiest way out. That is the easiest way out. You shoot me in my brain, I only got to feel two seconds of pain, and then I don't got to look at you or look at nobody no more. That's easy. It's, it's that, that mental shit. That, it's that torture. That's the real pain.